Hey, it was good, people. Back playing Doom. And I figured out, uh, oh, whoops. Uh, get in here and tell you guys my setup. All right, because this time it's working great. There's a few things that I find annoying, but I've been able to overlook it because I've been able to get so many much more things working fantastic. All right, first, I am not using the newest um, mod version. Whoa, where are you at? All right, so I am... Like I was saying, I would, I'm not using the newest mod version uh, because the turn in the newest mod version wouldn't work all the time. It would work for a little bit and stick, work for a little bit and stick, but this time it works fantastic. There's no hiccup with the turn, so uh, so that's why I um, I went back to this one. So I saw someone else said it online that they were able to get the touch working perfect with this mod, and I think it's a uh, I think it's the fourth version. Hey, you up here, quickly. All right. So I think it's the fourth I mod. The only one still alive. I can't believe I found you. Something happened. I don't know what. It, it was like a shock wave. It, it passed through the entire base. Now, even though they're 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 a little boxy, crazy. the graphics is fantastic. And I don't know what it is about it, but I don't even notice the um the screen door Please. effect. Now let me and let me walk away from this dude so I can freaking talk for a second. All right, now time to tell you guys what I have. So the fur um the thumbstick on the left hand um control pad here gives me my light all right the trigger on that one makes you jump the grip thing is my sprint all right there is no crouch button all right so that I wish there was because the the a and the, um, the X button on here absolutely does nothing all right um the B button now brings up pauses the game, which I don't know why they didn't let you the menu button over here do it, but it pauses the game. So it is what it is. Over here brings up my little PDA pad. All right, so get get rid of that, that out my face right now. I don't know why my air pad doesn't seem to be just sticking. Right, okay. Now. So you say, okay, you can't duck. What can you do? Since you can't crouch, this is what I did. I just leaned down. Be careful. I don't know. If and he gets me where I need to go. So, all right, let me get back out here. All right, so. Now, the reload is the thumbstick on the uh, right-hand controller. I just click that. Reload. The grip on that one changes the weapons. And it it's like magnificent how that works. Like boom. I can be in mid like mid combat, boom, hit that button, and boom, it switches over guns, and I'm laying I'm like mulling things down. This is fantastic. Now, um one of the guys modding the game says something about Holding the grip and then reaching your hand behind your back and pulling out a gun. Way too much work. This fantastic. I don't think I'm going to, um, even when they do the updates, I don't think I'm going to switch off from this, this version. Only because it's allowing me to play the game exactly where I want it right now. And my only, 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 um, the only negative is that no crouch and that I actually have to now bend over in order to do it. But... I'm, I'm, I highly doubt there's going to be too many times that I'm crouching behind anything that, that really makes that much of a difference to me. But it would have been awesome to... Um, actually, I would have preferred to have the jump button on the... On, the, um, on my A right here. But the fact that now I don't have to take my hands off the stick in order to do the jumps, fantastic. And 
So let's get into some gunplay so you guys can see how this all works. Some bam, bam, bam. Look at that. You see how I was able to switch over when, when the things, when I, it felt like I was getting a little bit overwhelmed. Now I always reload when it when it's a little bit of downtime, on both weapons. There's got to be more stuff to shoot. All right, I picked up a new gun. All right, so let's reload this bad boy right here. Reload, all right. Well, let's go to that gun. All right, let's check this thing out. In most games I tend to like the to stay with the um Mandate cure. This is Specialist Wilson. My team is gone. They're all dead. I'm running blind here. What are my orders? Over. Specialist Wilson, this is Sergeant Kelly. Stay sharp, son. Look to your last known RP and fortify your position. We'll find you. Alright, so let me Oh, damn it. The door's all messed up. I guess I have to find another way around this shit. Alright, let's go. Hmm. Man, it is bloody in here. Alright, that's where I just came from. Man, this dude's head's ripped off. <laughs> Alright, let's... Um, it looks like that... There has to be a way through... Alright, here we go. I love assault rifles. Is someone shooting me? Right, before I get out there, I want to find everything that I can use in here. Alright. Like I said, I want to make sure all my weapons are reloaded. Headshot! <laughs> Yo, and you know what though? Like, this feels so good. Whoops. Whoops. I gotta get out of the hand, the habit of um, squeezing that uh, one thing though, that because sometimes I'm in the middle of, I can't, I guess it's maybe like a panic a little bit, and then I squeeze the wrong thing. So, all right, light back on. This needs to be reloaded. All right, and all right, reload. All right, that's good. Back over this bad boy, reload him. All right. All right, pick up some ammo there. Any more ammo around? I don't even know what that is over here.
Oh, I guess my light runs out of... Oh, all right, I see, I see it. All right, don't need that on all the time. <laughs> Just ask my health a bit. Is there any more? See, I'm so not used to first person shooters with health all of a sudden again. I keep forgetting this is like an old school thing, you know? Oh shit! Oh man, that's me dead. <laughs> wow. Well. I guess what that gives you guys a great example of um of this, you know what I mean? Uh, the um the touch and, and everything like that. And like I said, give you guys the settings that I, I have. All right, now oh which I really didn't talk enough about the some of the settings that I, I did do. Let it go back into it. Uh, all right. So one of the things I didn't talk about, I told you what, how I have the, the control set up, which is the, you know what I mean, bam, these certain things. Um, I thought this guy shut up, let me continue. Okay, so you, I forgot a couple other things that you have to set. First of all, VR seat position has to be set to zero and VR turning has to be set to one. Uh, you need both those things in place for yeah you need both those things in place in order to then um be able to experience you know I me mean, get the full experience the way I, I have it all set up now so that brings us to everything of the setting so um so yeah you 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 have um like i said you have VR settings, uh, VR seating set to zero, VR turning set to one. I know I can change the height so my character won't look so short and close to the ground. That's something I'll probably do in a little bit. Um, but that's that's easy. You guys can figure that out. And personally, it's it it really isn't affecting the overall game. It just looked like my guys like a little like um like a little munchkin on the ground, like a little kid running around with guns in his hands. <laughs> um, but the fact that, like I said, um, this changes the weapon, and and that is automatic. I, I have to tell you now, that is automatically done. If when you when you load in the um, the version four of the mod, so version four of the mod, automatic. But is normally both of these are the things. So, but I changed this hand for my sprint. Because then it makes doing the sprint so much more easier, and that for my light, because that for some reason, in, in, you know, I think it works very well for me, and and for my jump also working pretty well for me. So aiming, everything, all good. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. My new favorite game, uh, and I hope. Uh, other studio well even though this was a mod and not a studio done thing I think I think it would be nice if uh, other studios follow suit and started doing the same thing with their games because this is perfect I couldn't ask for any more a button to crouch would be yeah I could ask for more a button to crouch would be fine and actually if the game if this game was 100% built for VR. Well, first of all, if it was 100% built for VR, I don't think the de uh, developers would have done this. It would have been some old stupid crap because they, they're all overly hey, concerned with, with people getting sick. But I got to stop now because this video is probably running way too long. 
and I'm going to be continuing playing myself, but I'm going to stop filming. All right. Have a good one, people.